Hello and welcome in our YouTube channel Metallurgical Facts. Subscribe our channel and press bell icon to get notification. You can also follow us on our Facebook and Instagram page for daily quizzes and practice. In case of any query, write us on metallurgicalfacts at the red gmail.com. So here is the objective of this video. The main purpose of this video is to introduce the term metallurgy and metallurgist. So first of all, we will see the historical notes related to the metallurgy. Then we will see what is metallurgy. After understanding these terms, we will move to the metallurgy and metallurgist. In historical notes, so starting from uh, the stone age, in this age, people used the stone made weapons while they were living in the caves. The existence of this age was about 30 lakh BC. The next one is copper age. The, the existence of this age was from 3500 to 2000 BC. The first metal copper was used in this age and the reduction of copper took place in this age. Further, bronze age from 2000 to 1000 BC. This was the actual period where metallurgy came into the existence. People started using alloys of the copper. Moving to the next age that is iron age. The existence of this age was from 1000 to 1 BC. In this age, the iron making discovery has been done. Iron wheels was used. After uh, 1500, the blast furnace was invented and the production of pig iron took place from blast furnace route. In, in, year, to, in year 1855, Sir Henry Bessemer discovered a steel making route for the production of steel from iron. In the year 1886, electrochemical process for extraction of aluminium from alumina has been discovered and the process was named as hall herald process. In 1900, the term physical metallurgy, crystal physics, modern physics, solid state physics, statistical physics was first introduced. However, metallography and crystallography already introduced in 1800. In 1950, material science and engineering was first introduced. In 20th century, many other steel making processes such as LD steel, electric arc furnace, steel making, and the secondary steel making process for high quality steel was introduced. In 21st century, smart material and nano science and technology has been uh, discovered. So now we will see what actually the metallurgy is. The metallurgy, the science that explains methods of refining and extracting metals from their ore and preparing them. Today, in the world of rapid development, the subject of metallurgy digs deeper into the heart of materials and metals than this definition describes. Metallurgy can be divided into two parts that is ferrous metallurgy and non-ferrous metallurgy. Ferrous metallurgy is the study of metals that use iron as their basic ingredient. Iron and steel are prime focus of the ferrous metallurgy. While in non-ferrous metallurgy, this is the study of metals that do not use iron as a principal alloying element such as copper, aluminium, lead. Metallurgy is more than examine the refinement and extraction of metals from their ores. Moving, to, uh, moving towards this, the ferrous and non-ferrous metallurgy studies can be done by using the sub-branches of the metallurgy that is mineral dressing, chemical metallurgy, physical metallurgy, mechanical metallurgy and powder metallurgy. Under these subjects, we study extraction properties, behavior and internal structure of materials and metals. These also teaches us that properties of metals can be changed by using various processes. The study of metallurgy actually explores what makes metal behave the way they do. This exploring is done by the person who probe deeply inside the internal structure of metal known as metallurgist. Metallurgist is the artist who creates various materials using different elements of periodic table. For a metallurgist, for a metallurgist, materials and elements are like a palette of color to an artist. Just an artist can create different paintings by different colors. Metallurgists create and improve upon different materials by different elements of periodic table and different synthesis and processing routes. The principal goals of metallurgists are to make existing materials better and invent or discover new phenomena and applications. Thank you everyone for giving attention towards our video and we want to let you know the upcoming video in this channel is about metallurgist versus industrial problem. Thank you once again.